yes, it's tough out there for farmers. We've got, you know, low commodity prices, plenty of supply, um, and farmers are not getting enough at the farm gate. And so that's why we've got an inquiry into farm gate prices. And next week we've got the big retailers in to question them. Are they giving a fair price to farmers? Those are the sort of issues we're talking about. And we can make sure that the public procurement, if it be at the health service, be it schools, be it the army, that we're actually buying British food. We can also make sure that there's proper labelling, country of origin labelling, especially on, on, on meat um, and on poultry and on eggs, so that people know where they're buying and what they're buying. People trust British food, uh, and so the supermarkets like to stock British food, and they want to make sure that we pay a, a, the the producer enough so that that product is there. Um, I've talked to you about the drainage so I shan't uh, reiterate about that um, but we uh, I have two appeals with the Minister uh, on our uh, amount of money we pay the EA. Uh, it's a very very difficult time and it's not just one year it's not just a short period of time it's year after year after year prices are going down a bumper harvest which is twice the work for half the money has exacerbated other problems but it was at one point just the dairy industry that's really suffering but other sectors are suffering really badly now as well the government needs to act there's no question about it and and we need to get the supermarkets to be part of this discussion we need to get consumers make sure the consumers are aware of what they're buying and where they're buying it from so we need to get more British produce on the shelves we need to get better labeling and we need to make sure the supermarkets are offering a better deal to farmers. We need to get the consumers so that they will buy more British produce and know that they can, they're giving farmers a decent deal when they're doing that. But also government's got to play a part too. It's got to buy more British produce but also it, it's got to listen to the industry and act where it can in terms of helping that situation. And that's what today's about, trying to get government to hear what's actually going on at the sharp end.